Here we go, here we go, another week. Got done with our first term of the year. That was not good. Show you, uh, got a couple fish I caught were all quality, but I was just off. We'll be showing you that on uh, Thursday, the whole tournament for that one. Um, I gotta do some different things for practice, but update, the boat is back. You can see his sun, everything. Boat's back, axle's done. So, boat for sale. And then, uh, so we got that, we got her rigged up. Just clean it out right now, get it all ready. Well, we're also rigging the other boat, waiting for more mounts and stuff. So, it's been quite a week. We got another tournament on Tuesday, which will be sweet. We're hopefully going to Mille Lacs tomorrow, because then we got the Pro-Am for Classic Bass then, which, uh, we'll see how that goes. That will be, uh, Pretty good time for that one. Gonna need some big weights. Malax has always been Achilles heel for me. Good one day, bad the next. Hopefully this is a time where it's phenomenal the one day. So we're just here getting stuff together, getting ready for some smallies, which will hopefully be next practice. Here we go. We just got done watching Ashen run her first 5K, uh, official 5K, and uh, Super proud of her, and so uh, happy for her. It's pretty cool to watch. Parents came and everything. But tournament fishing is a heck of a world. You can't stay down on yourself. You got to stay positive. So we're getting up to Mille Lacs just here for a little bit. We're gonna get here later, even with storms and everything, just to get a little bit of extra time on proams coming. We actually leave this next Friday. This is Saturday, and so you got to keep going. I learned a lot from Okaboji. Really threw me for a loop that uh, I stuck with those deep fish and it was not the call. So, gotta pull yourself back up and get there. And uh, we're going up to Mille Lacs. It's been quite the Achilles heel over the years. We gotta figure something out. Sounds like there's still some spawning fish. So, we're loading up the boat. You can see it behind me. We haven't been able to fish. We uh, just been working on the boat. The old boat, all that stuff, trying to get stuff together. So, loading up, Black's next. this point, I can't tell it's the next day, uh, I had to figure out if we were going to keep doing what we were doing, but we were on a side of the lake, I usually don't get to fish, I think I was just kind of going with the pattern, Mille Lacs is just like that, it is such a mind thing that it's, you know, you can just crush them and the next day it just completely goes the other way, and so kind of just made the decision that I was going to try to find as many of these areas as I could, even if I didn't catch them all, but they're real bitey. You could just, they were biting. So we kind of just went with it. Um, it was so windy we had to stick in areas without a wind and kind of just learn the lake. There's another whole week and I'm sure they'll change again. Mille Lacs has just always been an Achilles heel for me. You have this day where you completely figure it out and the next day completely, completely opposite. And this day was like one of those days they were biting. So I kind of made the decision. The, 
crappy part of tournament fishing that I was just going to try to find some more of these areas, get out of the wind, and I think that's going to have to be the strategy. We'll see how my practice time is here in a couple days. Kind of one of the reasons why I'm actually showing you this video before the tournament is because I don't know how it's going to play out. Matt. Malax is just such an animal that it can be a head scratcher and like this day absolutely on fire and when you figure it out like that. So I'm trying to keep the right headspace that I don't get too dialed into what I was doing yesterday. It's very difficult just to find some other areas. So here's some more. That's just a little bit of what I was thinking. You need me out on Spalock. I can help you if it's a jumbo. Solid one. You got him? Or you want some help? I'd say he's a four pounder. Heck yeah, man. Yeah. Take that one. I'm a jumbo. As big as yours. Oh. No. No. It's still a good one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh, buddy. Three pounder. Three solid and a half. one. Three and a half. Yep. Solid fish. What he did on my pig. Yep. <laughs> there you go. He demolished it. Solid. Heck yeah, man. I don't know. Solid one. Oh, that one has any small on yet. Look at this. No way. You don't think so? No. We got uh, our first night tournament is uh, two nights from now. We're going to get out practice for a little bit, but uh, I don't have enough time to edit the video before that one. We'll have a full video here soon. We'll have a full video of the Champs Tour. Uh, what actually, 
the couple that I caught there will be on Thursday. So um, that's what we got going on. The boat stuff's finally getting, uh, we got a bracket on there. We had to get the 360 together, but it's starting to come together. Now we got the animal trying to sell the other one. So that's what's been going on. I'm ready to get out and get fishing, trying to get back into the mood. You have to get out and go fishing. This tournament fishing deal is even as bad as the chance tour thing was. Um, you just got to get back out there and get them, just like this Mille Lacs deal. You just can't let it put you down like that. I was off. I was close to a couple areas that people caught them. I just was off. That big one I caught in practice just threw me off, and you just can't let that put you down the way this is. You know, you might have a bad call, but I feel it's uh, good times are coming. So, Well, we just got the call or text that uh, our tournament's probably going to get canceled here on Forest. So probably going to try to lean into a couple. Didn't bring the GoPro since we were uh, just practicing today, but we'll show you what we get. We got one two pounder so far and we've been bit off a bunch by a little pike. So I'll show you what we catch. We can then tear them up a little bit, I guess now. Soon as I say that, a couple pitches later, this little duder. Not a big one, but bit it good. Just throwing a June bug. Throwing a June bug. Pitching a June bug up in some weeds right here. Boat. Well, that was something. Uh, starting a storm, but whew, that was brutal. I guess good thing that they decided that they were gonna cancel the tournament for storms because that was not good. I think we got one two pounder. We ended up fishing some docks. We caught some real, real little ones, 12 inches and stuff. Tried deep. We tried in between for a long time. We tried shallow for a little bit. Caught super, super babies. If something's up, there's a lot of foil out on the lake right now, which kind of surprises me, but uh, we're just off. Not good. So I'm gonna have to recalibrate, get all of our rods and stuff put away, and uh, we will uh, be out again. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you.